Marriage is not a success, and this is coming from dancer Cora Obidi. <clears throat> okay, I think this is a conversation that um, has been overflogged. I, I feel like everyone should just decide what is success to them and what mm. is not success. And I like I always say, if marriage is success for you, then congratulations, work at it, and don't work at it in the, with the mindset of if it fails, then I'm, my life is over. If it fails, or if, if I don't even, you know, if I don't get yeah. Married, so just be open-minded, be hopeful when it comes through. Put in everything you've got to make sure it works and if it doesn't work it is not the end of life there are so many successes to record in every other area of your life that's how I, I mean see people it. Tr um, try marriage and then you fail and they will try again and mm -hmm. they will have it yeah, yeah, yeah. it's just a like like business like, yeah you do business you fail i mean some of the businessmen we celebrate now will tell you that they failed in they've had so many failed yeah. attempts at businesses I, I mean i think almost every businessman have that kind that of story, story right mm -hmm. so same thing in marriage if you say it's a success thumbs up and so I think it becomes more successful when your marriage is a success, right? Mm. So hopefully her own is a success because she's married, right? Yeah. I, I read that she celebrated her one year anniversary. anniversary yeah. So I guess that is a success to her, but that's good also. I'm, I'm on you 100% everything <laughs> you said because I'm in this conversation, I'm just really tired of it. Mm. Define your own success. If you think Simple. to you marriage is a success, yeah. Pursue it and get it. Mm -hmm. But if you think it's not, it's okay. No, I, one thing is that people should stop putting pressure on people. Mm -hmm. Let them decide if they want, for they want marriage or not. I think this is off the back of um, our putting out that uh, the bad girls actually are the ones getting married and mm -hmm. the good girls do not get married and all of that. And then to like um, that it's not a success. But like Elsie rightly said, you need to define what success means to you. Mm. If um, there are a lot of people that they do not care, they set a goal for themselves. By the time I'm 23, I want to get married. And if they're not married at that stage, they feel like they're not fulfilled. Mm. Do you understand? So it's how you place success. Mm -hmm. It's how you place your fulfillment. Do you understand at the end of the day? So I feel like um, a lot of women need to just break that chain or that stereotype of um, if I'm not married, I'm not equal to my mates who are married. Because a lot of these married women are not even happy in their marriages. Yeah, but they forget that they're not happy when they leave the house. So mm. they're looking at the young girl, the single girl, and like, why are you not married? Like, I don't know if it's a case of amnesia, but they kind of forget that they're not happy. <laughs> yeah, do you understand? So at the end of the day, you need to focus on yourself, build yourself. Marriage is not going to build you to be who you want to mm. be. Do you understand? It's about, um, let's use token marking words, well, work on yourself mm. and keep working on yourself. Mm. That is the definition of success. When you have that self-fulfillment, not what the society expects from you, not because people say that, oh, at, when you're 35 and you're not married, then you, you're not a complete woman. That is not what success is all about. Because there are a lot of single women out there who are doing very well in their um, respective businesses, in their respective um, relationship with friends, you know, and all of that. And then things are working out for them. Now, that is their definition of success. But if you feel, okay, ah, even, then you settle for less at the end of the day because you feel that if I'm not married, I'm not successful. So it's it's not about that. And I think that um, I agree with um, Cora Obidi on this one, that marriage is not a success. And then maybe she's just okay, trying so to... So for you, marriage is not a success? Well, for me, marriage is not even an achievement to start with. I, I, I don't mind dying. A successful marriage is an achievement. It, well, when, like you said, a successful mm -hmm. marriage. Not a marriage that comes with a lot of rumors, that comes with a lot of side talks, that comes with a lot of problems. How is that success? How is that something that gives me headache every day? I wake up, how is that me being successful? Because people see me with a ring on my finger and then they believe that, oh, yeah, I'm, yeah, yeah, responsible. Okay, so, man. I mean, 
as you, you were just talking about how if it gives you problem and it just came to my mind that maybe the people that can say if marriage is a success or not <laughs> are people that, that are already get. married because you don't know what it feels like until you're in it already so yeah i mean she's married and she's saying it's not an achievement mm. yeah that's what i said maybe but she, there are people, people who are yeah. also married that will tell you it is a success and yeah. it is an achievement and, so um, just that's that's when <laughs> that's when the marriage is actually Okay, when you say marriage is a success, then you have to be better off than what you were before you got married. Do you understand? That's when I would say that marriage is a success. Do you understand? Like, when you get married and then you're better off than when you were single. But if you're still on the same level after you got married, please sister brother how is that a success well the same level itself we have to define the levels you're talking about yeah. honestly it's okay and then there's one there's one thing now um you, you mentioned something that she said and i wanted to just comment um on when she talked about is the good bad girls that are getting married and the, please any good girl out there don't let anybody deceive you i feel like people i mean it, it just works for people differently mm. and then it's timing that matters at the end of the day you might not be married mm. now it might sure. not just be your time so mm. don't let it, let anybody <laughs> deceive you that it's just the bad girls that I are don't really think the there's world. a time frame to marriage <laughs> Well, if, bad girls are getting married, you know? Yeah, so <laughs> anyway. if, you, if you find love at 60... But who is a bad girl, though? That's it. I mean, that's that's another question. That's it's uh, very what's, relative. What's the name of this girl that twerks on the Instagram that just got Jemina. married? Jemina. Jemina. She's married. Yes, she she twerks her way to marriage. <laughs>